Hi, I'm Nadav. Welcome to PAX Online, and this is... Weird. Skip that intro. Later, alligators, the name of the game. We're gonna just give it a quick try. It's very point and click, so I don't know how long I will want to do this. Nothing wrong with point and click, just for a demo. Let's talk to these rough, gruff guys. Bonnie, take the shot, Rocco. Hold your horses, Bonnie. I'm lining up my stick. You gotta be delicate with these things. Oh, I've been holding my horses. I've been cradling my horses. I've enveloped my horses in the safety of a tender, meaningful embrace all night waiting for you to take the shot, Rocco. How come you never hold me like that, Bomb? Joni. Hey there, you up for a real challenge? I haven't seen you here before, stranger. Alligator New York City is a big place, but we tend to have regulars, you know? Like Rocco and Bonnie over there. Those two are here every day, but you... I don't remember such a visible face like yours. Ah, uh, look at me being a real jerk. I don't mean to be giving you a hard time or nothing. I've just been a little frazzled since last night. I had a dream that I was a ski ball and some sticky finger kid kept throwing me into the 10 point hole. Go for the 50 dingus, I tried to yell, but being a ball and all, the ding dong couldn't hear me. I woke up in a cold sweat in my kitchen systematically. Systematically, yeah. Throwing individual oranges from the window into my neighbor's terrarium. The vitamin C would have helped me shake it off. But all I had for breakfast was black coffee and a half can of leftover candy cigarettes. The name's Joni, of Bologna. If you're my fourth grade bully, come back to fight me. You're not, right, Sam? Anyway, I work here as at Adelaide's Arcade, sweeping floors and keeping all the games running smooth as a baby's balmy behind. I used to work as a greaser in a shop downtown, but I left to be close to my gaming hobby. They let me keep the leather jacket, though. And the company hairstyle. Pat? Pat's my cousin, also the most genuine doof I know, so you better be nice to him, you hear? I wouldn't want to have you to pop you one. I'm told I got a mean left hook and a moderately insulting right hook. And a kick that could benefit from some anger management courses. I tried to sign up for some calming hot yoga at the YACA. Not the YMCA. But the... Ah, uh, the... Why alligator CA? Anyways, but it didn't go over well. You ever get kicked by your own leg? It ain't great, bud. It ain't great. The event? Look, I know you're here spying for Pat for whatever reason, and that's fine, but I can't tell you family secrets, you feel me? To give up info that hot, you'd have to really impress me. So what do you think? Can you roll the ball, old timer? I'm talking pinball, the old pinny bee, as I like to call it, against the advice of... Both my friends, family, and the supportive therapist I see on Thursdays. I got the highest score on Lizard Wizards here eight months running, but I'm always looking for a real pinhead to pit my skills against. So what do you say, care to take me on a pinball lizard like me? I didn't mean to make a joke, I take this very seriously. Whew. I will play. Click the plunger to launch the pinball. Control the flippers by clicking right and left, or by okay. Okay, I need to use the arrow keys. That makes more sense. Oh, that's the worst. But oh, that's so many lives. How could I not get 5,000? This pinball machine is the worst! Huh. I'm not gonna do it, am I? I got your high score. I didn't beat it. Sure. 
You got a family member badge. Oh, geez. Hey, it's been a long time since I've seen moves like that in front of lizard wizards here. You had that ball hitting all the do what's and who's it's so fast I could barely keep up. It's been a real honor to hang with you, another student of the pinball arts. Oh, geez. About the event. Now, this might just be a rumor, but word on the street, there's going to be some sick games there. Not pinball per se, but you know, you take what you can get. Anyways, that's all I can really say. I'd better get back on the grind trying to beat my last high score. Thanks for showing me your supple wrist, Finhead. Catch you later. Whew! Yeah, the train movie remake was passable. But if you ask me, nothing beats the part in the original where a train leaps into the air and the harness holding the actor breaks. If you stay after the credits, you see the footage where he falls into the camera guy and a makeup artist holding two coffins. Hey up there, long arms, you gotta say. Nice suit, what's a fancy rope tie like you doing at the back of the arcade? I know what you're after. That's right, I've got you pegged just by looking at you. You want cold, hard, plush. Well, you found the right alligator. And I've got a job that'll pay for both of our retirements and poorly made stuffies. You might see a humble claw machine, but this is a vault. And we're gonna break in. But we can't just walk in, no, there's a countermeasure. Sometimes normally the security guard comes by and says I'm not allowed to put my claw chair into the aisle. Without the boost, I'm not tall enough to work the claw. She says it's a fire hazard, but most of the machines in here are. You see behind here? That's one ailing power strip juicing up every one of those babies. One wrong move in pinball and boom, this place lights up like my chemistry teacher's hair when I turn that Bunsen burner too high. Me? I'm not around these parts of Sweet Geraldine, criminal mastermind of the claw machine. If you haven't heard of me? Honestly, I'm not surprised. I leave no fingerprints and Johnny Law doesn't have a clue. Or Johnny Boyer from my geography class, and at least that's what he said when I asked him to the spring fling. Pat? Pat is a patsy, but not my patsy, that's for sure. He's related to some of my dad's friends. One time, a dad show, Pat pulled the fire alarm because he thought someone was trying to set him on fire. Turns out he just had a warm piece of pizza in his pocket. No one could find him for almost an hour until the firefighters pulled him out of the concert hall's crawl space. He was covered in spiders and had eaten the pizza, but was otherwise unharmed, physically anyway. That guy's pretty weird. I'd love to tell you about the event, I really would. But this is our first time on the job together, Mac. You haven't yet earned my unbridled trust. Alright, let's do it. Maybe we could come to a mutual beneficial arrangement. The claw machine is a two-man operation. I need someone who's not going to sell me down the river for an additional prizes when plush comes to shove, you feel me? What do you say, old timer? One last claw machine score, the big one. Whew! Okay, we're going to do the claw machine, grab prizes as she advises, and then we're going to settle. Click left and right to control the crane. crane. When you're ready to grab, click the center button. Okay. We got another cat visitor. I heard a prize. Let's check the slot. My dad said I'm not supposed to have too much candy because I got hyperactive and prone to fits of father pinching. But I think he just likes keeping it all for himself. You've got some chops, I respect that, but now the real job begins. How's will you react when the pressure's on? This time you follow my lead. Oh, big diamond, that's a beauty. Give me that humongous gem. One tap. And a swing. Got it. You got one, what is it? They say diamonds are a girl's best friend, so I'm looking forward to getting deep into some alligator settlers of Catan with this baby. You're really good at this, but it's finally time for the big score. I can see it in your eyes. You're ready to get the ultimate prize. Get me the doll from the best, most awesome video game franchise of all time, Final Friend City. Ha, Final Fantasy. He's the dreamy one with the spiky hair. That's it, the big one. 
The one with the spiky hair. The one at the bottom. Okay, let's see. No. It's a diamond. I see the Final Fantasy knockoff. Oh, you dastardly. Nope. Oh, I needed the puzzle piece anyways. That's funny. Here we go. Got it. Can't believe you got the dreamiest anime game boy from Final Friend City. Claude Stripes. Cloud Strife. Claude. His hair is almost as prickly as his social interactions with women. This is exactly what I wanted. Thank you so much for helping me. Okay. We won. That's enough for me. Thank you for watching. If you're interested in this game, let me know down in the comments. It is punny. Like this video if you liked it, subscribe if you want to support Mongo Nation, and ring the notification bell if you want to be notified when new videos are coming out. I'm Nadav, and this is Mongo Nation, signing off. Thanks for watching.